Hi, I'm Rob from Curry's PC World and today we're going to be going to our living room setup at the studio where I'm going to be giving you three top tips of how to get the most out of your viewing experience on your telly. Number one, how to select your picture mode. Number two, choosing your brightness. And number three, sorting out your contrast. So the first thing that we're going to look at is picture mode. Now most TVs will have a couple of presets from their manufacturer and they might be called things such as cinema, standard and vivid. Now on some TVs this might also be known as dynamic. Now whilst this might look impressive it is important to know that vivid and dynamic oversaturate the colours so you might lose a little bit of the picture quality. So personally I'd go with cinema as this has the most accurate colours. Also if you're a gamer you might want to see if your TV has a gaming mode because if it does, chuck it on while you're gaming. What this does is it cuts out a lot of the picture processing which means your uh, reactions are gonna be a lot quicker on screen. Secondly, let's take a look at the brightness. Now, brightness is the overall brightness of the image on screen. Some manufacturers, they'll have a recommended level. This manufacturer here recommends it at 100%, but you can adapt this for the brightness of your room. So if you've got the lights on, you might want it at 100%. However, if your room's slightly darker, you might want to lower the brightness so that you get rid of the glare from the screen so that you can protect your eyes. Some TVs might even have automatic brightness, the light sensor. What this does is it senses the ambient light and adapts the TV to adjust. And third, we're gonna take a look at your contrast. Now, contrast is how bright your brights are and how dark your darks are. Again, there's a recommended from the manufacturer, but if there isn't a recommendation, normally, the higher the better. However, it is important to note that with some tellies, you might lose a little bit of the finer detail when you push it up right to the max. So it's always worth just having a play around to make sure you're not losing that detail if you put it up to 100%. If you wanna know any more about how to get the best picture on your TV or anything else to do with your telly, visit us in store or online at curries.co.uk.